I showed this to a friend of mine who's also on Ignister to ask him, like, do you see how to win this game? And he did not see it, so I figured this was a save like a shareable replay, share worthy replay. This okay. one's this one's a little trickier because this one isn't just like oh, just do access code and kill them like every other game. I mean, it, it still is eventually, but uh, our opponent just kind of set one and passed. So okay, that's usually a really that's a green light to just try and to kill him. Oh, you've not really you've drawn really dicey. Like Ash brought some shots down your end. Yeah, I've drawn terribly, and he's got a Valor. And well, I already have not... the field spell. Like, yeah, that's pretty bad. So I'm just gonna poke him for eight. I'm not gonna waste an infant. I've already got the field spell, and I set an imperm, and I take twenty three hundred from I met you because I played it. Yeah, and good thing they played up star, right? If you have the oh, they're playing <laughs> Sky Striker. Okay, you're fine because you know that the opponent can't make you because they're playing Sky Striker and they've made the wrong choice. They came to play you. <laughs> I, I had an Ash and an imperm. I did feel pretty comfortable. And like, yeah, yeah this will like... dump engage, and then you imperm the Kagari in main phase two to turn off the engage. Yeah, you've also got the Kaiju, which is going to turn off the Imperm's entire back row, right? Right. So, Imperm turns off that back row for now, but as soon as he ends his turn, it turns back on, but... Yeah, as soon as you Kaiju, the opponent's then um, stuck with a monster in their main monster zone, so all their Widow Anchor is there. Right. So, he's going to go for Shizuku, he's going to get the Search. Yeah, it can't be engaged, because they've already got one in the graveyard. So he goes for Widow Anchor, yeah. Which is still in his hand. Yeah, so, not deployed, so. so I know he's got a Widow Anchor in his hand, and I draw a name. I've got a body. Thank God, we've got a body. This is great. Give him the Kaiju so I don't get Widow Anchored. Summon Picari, and it was an Imperm. <laughs> How do you win the duel from here? Um, Let's see. You can go... Infant doesn't get you anything. It just gets you another fifth spell. You play all the same cards as me, right? Yep. So we have the exact same deck list, I believe. If you pass, you lose because they just do Sky Striker stuff, and then you're not going to play through that. Does it end this turn? No. Okay, so you have to get through next turn as well. Yes. Okay. But there is a line that you do this turn that ensures victory, more or less. They could. The only way they win is if they have Area Zero for the Kaiju. Right. So you're going to have to. You've already normal summoned, right? Yes. I'm actually struggling with this dual puzzle. Uh, can I see your extra deck? Uh, scroll down. So. Yeah, you've only got access to infant. How on earth do you do this? I can't, I can't actually see it in my head. So, this is one of those things where I said, like, once in a while you have to freestyle and do really weird things. And really weird things includes. that setting the field spell over the first one. Oh right yeah so that you have your monster won't get destroyed by battle i have so three spells in grave <laughs> mind control <laughs> uh, okay yeah that's better that eagle boosters has been super super sweet i can't it, it's just been so good at just like forcing through access code to occur it on, guarantees on a like... body on the following turn yeah Alright, and now you've got... Unless they've got third interaction. Okay, yeah. You should be good to go from here. If you don't set the second island over the first one, you lose that duel. Yeah, because uh, your card gets destroyed by battle, right? Yeah. But he could have just played... Uh... Oh, of course, he had to draw in, like, engage or something in order to... Right, well, he had the Kaiju. Right. He couldn't have done basically anything. Except, like, yeah. Area Zero, the Kaiju off the board. Yeah, yeah. And it was by yeah. no stretch of the imagination a guaranteed victory for me. I was on 15. If he had Normal Summon Ray into Hayate, it was still game yeah. for him. But you have to play for the scenario where you can win. Yeah, 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 exactly. And update Jammer, update Jammer. Access Code Talker, All Might Smash. And, of course, the Royal one. <laughs> Just a start for extra star points, but yeah, your opponent can't respond to anything that Access Code Talker does. So you can actually like chain block it, which is really cool. Where you put like all of the optional effects underneath it, and then you've got the Access Code Talker on the top. Opponent can't respond to anything in your graveyard, and yeah, you just uh, 
resolve all of the uh, all of the stuff and then double swing for for games. He so. attacks twice if you use update jammer as one of the link materials. Yes. Yeah, update jammer is what makes access code talker uh, a real a real hero. Unfortunately, we okay. did find out that replays that happen in dual rooms can't be saved. So a couple ah, tournament okay. matches are gone. We had a really good replay where our opponent had two windows and you outed it using a kaiju and imperm in a specific order. And another just fantastic replay with a really good read on Nibiru. Uh, our opponent was really smart. And unfortunately for him, we were smarter and saw the Nibiru. But I don't have those replays. The only one, other one I have left is like... I, I call this replay how to 